Hi, I'm Albert, I'm 20 years old, and I want to show you how flexible I am. Saula, are you... Hello there, welcome to the video and thank you so much for clicking on it because you could have been doing anything and I trust and I know that you are going to really, really enjoy it. Now the first off, you are seeing a squat workout combined with an upper chest workout because like any other person who trains for weightlifting and physique, my upper chest is lagging and if you are new to the channel, welcome and I am a online personal trainer but I like to specifically help out beginners who are new to weightlifting or anyone who's just thinking about starting their fitness journey. So that could be if you're a teenager just thinking about getting in the gym or maybe you're a single mother of a family of children who's thinking of getting into an active and exercise routine and a good lifestyle. And I just preach that you can follow a good diet as well as a good exercise routine around a busy lifestyle and still enjoy yourself by going out with your friends and still be able to lose weight or gain muscle, whatever your goal may be. Now, what I did to start off with was 10 sets of five was my plan with 120 kilos on squats, but it was just feeling absolutely horrible on this day. I've no idea why, but... It was my rest day beforehand and I like to decrease my calories a little bit more so maybe I didn't have so much energy. Just in these cable crossovers, hopefully you can see that I am getting a bit leaner because on my left pet you can see the striations are starting to come in which is really making me happy. Um, yeah, with the 10 sets of 5 with 120 kilos of squats it was feeling horrible so I did a set of 4, a set of 4 and then the remaining 3 sets of 3 and then I dropped down to 100 kilos. 110 kilos for a set and then 100 kilos for four sets. So I did 10 sets in all, but I made sure that the amount of volume I did equated to what I would have done if I'd done 10 sets of five with 120 kilos. I really do hope you stick around for the rest of the video and enjoy yourselves. Her body's gold like September. She burns through the night like an ember. And all those things we try forgetting, I remember. But we say we all fine, we all fine. Sunny day dreams and we up now. Vodka lemonade, I serve it up, it goes down. 75 degrees. Alright, guys, this is Albert Aldridge of AlbertAldridgeFitness.com. And I hope you're enjoying my tips and fitness nutrition tips videos at the moment because I really do enjoy making them. And I've been getting some great feedback and I love responding to your comments so I really do appreciate that and also quickly at the start of this video I would advise you to add me on snapchat it's a fitness zero one if you want to see a full day of eating every day but I thought I'll do a little vlog today because what I'm planning on doing I know I give you a different video schedule every time pretty much I do a vlog or a video but I'd like to put fitness and nutrition tips up from Monday to Friday if I can and then do some sort of vlog on Saturday or Sunday. So something where I just take you through a refeed day because I usually have a refeed day today which is a Friday and I'll probably do that every week. And my refeed today is going to be 3,300 calories. I'm going to aim to hit around 170 to 180 grams of protein, minimal fat and then high, high carbohydrates. But obviously I allow myself some treats here and there. But if you are wondering about the diet, I've had some people questioning re recently about how long this diet is lasting and I started my diet in the last week of December 2015 and now it's currently May the 27th so I've been doing it for a very very long time but I've taken it very slow and taken frequent diet breaks and if you are wondering what a diet break is Bit simplistically, it's just taking a week off from your diet, but if you'd like me to go through that in more detail, then just leave me a comment in the section below. But I am wanting to lose a little bit more body fat because you would have just seen a physique, actually I'll put a physique update on the screen now in good lighting, but I'll also do a physique update in some more natural lighting later on in the video. And I do hope also that you enjoyed the workout footage, but I wanna get myself a little bit leaner. I'm losing weight on 2,900 calories at the moment, training six days a week, and I do a 12 minute warm up of cardio and a 12 minute cool down of cardio. 
which is relative, relatively intense. It's not high intensity, it's about RPE 6 or 7 out of 10. And then my workouts last around hour and 20 minutes, hour and 30 minutes. And that's what I'm really enjoying at the moment and really enjoying my diet. I do preach something called flexible fasting, which basically means make sure you get your protein in each day, 0.8 grams to a gram of protein per pound of body weight. And then, to be honest, as a personal trainer, this is what I preach because I believe that having a having a sustainable diet means that you can be very flexible about what you eat. So I say, obviously, try and get more carbohydrates than fat, but just don't be really strict and be worried about eating every two to three hours and all that malarkey. Just don't worry about it. Just make sure you spread your meals optimally so you perform well in training. But apart from that, just don't stress. What I personally usually like to do is fast mostly throughout the day and then by the evenings when I like to have a majority of my calories. So I start eating around 4 or 5 p.m. But today, as I'm doing a refeed day, it's currently 10 to 1. I'm eating 3,300 calories, so I am going to spread my meals a little bit more. I've come back from training back and biceps, but you will have seen training footage from another day. And today, I'm going to start off with, I've only had a black coffee so far, so I'm going to have some porridge, whey protein, and frozen berries with a chocolate chip rice cake to start of the day. So please make sure you leave a like on this video. I really do hope you enjoy it. Sit back and relax. Just before we move on to the first meal, you might be wondering why I'm not a lot leaner than I am right now, but that's just because I've been following a flexible diet and I want to show people who are beginners especially, who have just started their fitness journey, who or who are thinking of starting their fitness journey, and just people in general who are into fitness, that within three years of training, you can achieve a relatively decent physique with a decent body fat percentage, like you can see your abs and it's pretty impressive, but also eat things like magnums, cereal, I have chocolate chip rice cakes every day. If you follow me on Snapchat, you'll be able to see that. There'll be, um, my username is in the description of this video. So that's the reason I'm not a lot leaner just yet. I'm not sure how far I'd like to go, but I would like a little bit more lower ab definition, but I have been enjoying having my magnum still, having a good diet and enjoying my lifestyle. And you should enjoy your weight loss diet too. Always crash down and we feel them. Say here's to the nights we steal them And I'll be running cause I figured out The more I slow down the less I get out And if we fall let's be strong now Moving along we don't mind we don't mind Now the whey protein I use to put in my recipe called pour protein because it's porridge and protein and I'll put some frozen berries in at the end is one by a company called Olympus Health. Now this is what it looks like just here. It looks a little bit different. It's something I haven't seen before but I really do recommend this product for anyone who's a student, who's a beginner. Just because the product quality is amazing and their value for money is absolutely unreal compared to other protein powders. This five kilogram tub lasts me for a very long time and it only cost 29 99 that is insane and then it was three pounds i think three or four pounds post and packaging so essentially about 33 34 quid for five kilograms of protein with the packaging included so what i recommend you do is go in the description below don't use the link that i haven't got go to their website and then buy the product and don't use my link to get not get 10 percent off you get me and here is meal one of the day. I had a chocolate chip rice cake beforehand, but I've got 62 grams of oats and it's slightly hot in my hand. I'm gonna put it down. This is what it looks like. I put water on it, put it in the microwave for two and a half minutes, then took it out, added 25 grams of whey protein, put more water in it, put a lot of water in it to give it a lot of volume, then put it into the microwave for another one and a half minutes before I did about another 30 seconds, just so I didn't let it spill over the top, because I have done that before. And now I've added 180 grams of frozen summer berries from Tesco, which is around 68 calories. All in all, this whole meal, including the chocolate chip rice cake, is 407 457 calories and the contrast of the frozen berries with the hot porridge is absolutely amazing. Want something that's feeling all right? Loose cannon but still it won't fight. No need to leave, spend our whole lives. Another day in paradise. Yeah. Good Sunday morning to you all. Now I do apologize because 
During that reef feed day, I'm afraid I was called into work, so I had to go in and I wasn't able to film for the rest of the day because I came back very, very late. Now, at the moment, you would have seen, already seen the workout footage from this morning, so I'm just walking back, it's around 10 o'clock, and I'm gonna get picked up to go to church. I'm just walking past some weird medicine factory where they test on animals, I think, but what I'm gonna show you is I'm gonna have the oats that you saw on my reef feed day, exact same recipe which 60 grams of oats, the frozen berries, which I think is like 160 grams, and then 25 grams of whey protein. But then what I'm gonna have after that is my couscous concoction a bit later and probably a Cadbury's Highlight Hot Chocolate 40 calories. I'm sure I'll show you then, but the main thing I wanna show you is, because I preach flexible dieting, is a nice little snack I'm gonna have. So I'm gonna show you once I've been to church and said my prayers. Just to the nights we steal them And I'll be running cause I figured out the more I slow down, the less I get out And if we fall, let's be strong now Moving along, we don't mind, we don't mind All the good comes in waves I buy my time by the ocean And at night, I'm awake To feel the way Motion. And I want something that's feeling alright Loose cannon but still it won't fight No need to leave, spend our whole lives Another day in paradise Is the treat I was telling you about now it's 351 calories and it's it's okay you don't get much for it but it is still a treat now have a come have a look at this it's just down here right what we have here is you can see just in front of you just in front of the lens is a cookie dough ice cream sandwich and it's actually a lot smaller than it looks like on the packet and just here we've got two pieces of Toblerone now if this is like a little treat you might be wondering oh that's a little bit risky to have during a cut but I like to be flexible if you hopefully been paying attention during this video but that is what I preach so personally I like to enjoy treats like this every day because it makes sure that I stick to a diet and I am still getting leaner and if you'd like some help about how to get leaner with cutting or anything I do do online coaching and customized nutrition plans and workout plans as well as one-on-one -on -one personal training fitness classes now if you're interested in that I recently put up a, what we call a gig on fiverr.com so there'll be links to everything in the description below to my website and to fiverr if you are interested in that I'd love to help you and at the moment I'm on my laptop just catching up on a few online clients getting ready for an internship that I'm going to start on Tuesday at university and I'm constructing a business model plan which hopefully is going to be like an automatic thing so that's really exciting I can't wait to tell you about it I'm going to eat this now though and I'll bring you back to the next meal Mistakes we made, they made us who we are These games we played, they got us really far That shit to most will never mean a thing But it got us here Her body's go like September She burns through the night like an ember And all those things we try forgetting I remember But we say we all fine, we all fine Sunny day dreams and we up now a lemonade, I serve it up, it goes down 75 degrees in a dope sound Are you Unfortunately, it's come to that time and I'm in my garage again as you guys already know from all the Facebook lives that you've seen as well as my videos. If you haven't seen my Facebook live, there's a link to my Facebook page and my personal Facebook page in the YouTube description. I do them from Monday to Friday in the evening around 10pm UK time. So make sure you check in then because I always put up very helpful content for anyone starting a fitness journey or anyone who is already on one. I'm so sorry, I do talk quite a lot and this 
this video. I'm conscious that it's going to be quite long. I'm just going to put a physique update on the screen that is in more truthful lighting because I said I put that up earlier. But I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you smash that like button because it really helps out this channel. And I know a lot of people like watching my vlogs. Please leave a comment in the section below because I love to respond to your, all your comments and all the things that you like to say. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. There's been a button there all this video. So make sure you go and hit it now if you haven't already. And then share this with all your friends 